So I've completely uninstalled the game. I've deleted all local files. I am now attempting to reinstall the game from scratch, complete reinstallation. It's downloading the, the boot or the initial sequence files. It'll take just a couple of minutes. You will see the problem is that when I launch the program, it just won't download the 150 gigabytes that are needed to, to run the full game. And uh, you guys keep telling me that it has already been installed and I can show you clearly that it's not. It's, there are no files on my computer. I cannot run the game. The run will stall. I will show you where. Just give me one minute. Okay, so it's finished downloading the initial files, which are required to install the game. As from this point, it considers it as, a, as a, if you've been playing the game, which I haven't, it's just an installation process. I click on play, it boots up the, the game, it asks me for permissions, I say yes. first I will just close it down anyway. okay we're waiting for for the game to boot up As you can see it says playing it's loading. longer than usual. I'll do it again, just one second. Oh, it's still loading. <laughs> this 80 hours have been 79 installing the game over 50 different times at a 5 megabyte internet width and uh, it's very frustrating. No. So here's the, here's the game. Here, you should see the animation of the, of, of the planes flying across the bay and you know, all the nice introductory screen. It just loads up as if the game was already installed, which is not, and that's the, that's the problem. The game is not installed. But it loads up as it is, as if it were. <laughs> See, it goes directly to the screen where you have seen the animations beforehand. And when I click and press any key to start, look what happens. Welcome, set your experience. And that's it. It will stay there for hours. It will just stall there. And as we know, in this screen, there should be a window asking me to download the 150 gigabytes that are missing from the data, data files that are needed for the game, right? This screen should only appear if the game was properly installed, which it's not. I just showed you that, and I will again, that my hard drive does not contain the files. Let me show you, let me minimize this. So, if I go to my computer, it's PC, C, program files, Nvidia, no, actually your Steam. Sorry about that, I'm going too fast. Steam, Steam, apps, common, Play Simulator. It only contains these files, which account for barely, let's see, 
one gigabyte of data. When you know this file takes 150 gigabytes. So the game is not loading, it just stalls there. I cannot play it. Please help me install this properly. My computer has the latest Windows files. I will show you that as well, just to make sure you're complete. Um, see, it's, everything's up to date. I have the proper setting. If I look at my computer, let's look at system. My computer is very capable. Let me see what uh, about. See, it's a very powerful computer. The device is NVIDIA, a very advanced device. Let me show you that. Device manager. There are no conflicts in the computer, everything's working fine. I actually managed to play the game once, and then I had to format my computer because it did something else, and I just couldn't reinstall it from Steam again. I was going to show you the display drivers, NVIDIA GeForce GTX. So, please help me. I cannot play the game, and I paid a lot of money for it. Thank you.